Hey everybody, we are back at it again with Fears to Fathom. This is chapter Iron Bark Lookout. I'm excited for this one, so let's jump into this freaking game. Oh, do I have other games? I think I have other games. Fears to Fathom, Iron Bark Lookout, May 12th. Hey, I noticed you were requesting story submissions while I was watching YouTube YouTuber play Fears to Fathom Carson House. What I'm about to recount happened when I was 24 or so at the time. It feels kind of weird telling anyone about this because of the bizarre and absurd nature of the whole thing, but I feel like doing so might help me process my memories of it. I knew that sharing this story anywhere else would be a dumb idea because people would think I'm lying as I am writing this. This was the scariest experience of my life. Okay. I'm Jack Nicholson. I had a small job as a park ranger in a state park. I was a fire lookout stationed in one of the largest forests in the Pacific Northwest. Miles and miles of dense forests managed by the Forestry for Service. I had a salary that allowed me to make ends meet, but I couldn't afford to treat myself to restaurants, nice clothes, etc. My biggest accomplishments so far was a being able to buy an RV for myself with a lot of financial help from my dad. That RV was the only sense of home I had at the time. This one time I was transferred from one outpost to another because of some official circumstances. It was a minor inconvenience to me though, since I lived out of my RV and liked traveling. I said a few goodbyes and I was off to the new location. It was about a two hour drive. We get a drive. Yeah, listen to that fucking hammy, baby. Oh, oh shit. Press escape to read messages? Oh, this is a bad idea. I'm driving. Whoa, what the heck is- what is all this? There's a lot of things to read. Should I read all of them? I don't want to, but fuck it. When there's music playing. Congratulations on the transfer. Feeling ready for the change? Just reaching out to tell you that you've been assigned over to Tower 11. Welcome on board. This is Mitch, by the way, from the Iron Bark. Thank you. Heard a lot about you from Josh. Very excited to meet you soon. Just got my ID today. Your shift starts on the 12th. Sounds good. I'll be there. Anything I need to know? I have your papers, just bring your ID. Josh told me that the job is not news to you. Can you? Can I just ask you one question? Sure. Why did you pick this job initially? Not sure how to answer that. Uh, I just enjoy the thrill or the lack of it, I guess. I'm sorry, I just asked that question to everyone joining this line of work. People join looking for a getaway to discover who they are only to leave without notice. Guess they're better off in a cubicle. For me, I can't do city life. This is where I belong, and I'm sure I'd adapt just fine to iron bark. Good, I hope you fare better than the last lady. Where can I park my van? So you're arriving on a Friday. Just park your truck around back on Gravel Park by Gate D. Got it. Or okay, got it, thanks. You'll probably see below the gate, show them your ID. Okay, so K. We're messaging. Alright, got it. So, K is maybe a girlfriend or a friend. I don't fucking know. But she knows where we are. So that's good. I do like the music. The music is what I would call chill. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's a huge fucking truck coming. Hello. I ain't got no brakes. Just being surrounded by nature gave me happiness. I felt like I was at home in the woods. Like a ghost. She don't feel me 
anymore, she says I'm never home. I got no lights on, I'm stumped in my chair again. She never comes. Okay, I gotta stop moving my mouse because that's screwing me up. Oh god. Excuse me, babe. I hate to see that you miss me because the weather's cold and I'm knowing life is fast. And you know I got you, but I'm always on my ass. Fuck it though. When you rub, I'm feeling down, and when you're round, I'm feeling gone. I'm on my Oh, you're a little city. Oh, very nice. I saw there's diner Kylo was talking about. Okay, car. I missed the diner at first. Oh, I need to go to the diner. Oh shit. Let's go back to the diner. This is a nice RV, bruh. What the fuck is that? Oh shit, can we drive back there? We were turning this bitch around. Oh, there's a car coming. Is this really my turning radius? I hope there's nobody coming. All right, we're good. Come on, baby. Coming through. At a very, very slow rate of speed. Oh, sh shit. I don't know why my car has been disabled. Here we go. Woohoo. All right. Shut up. And we're here. We got our nice RV. Alright, we're just gonna go inside. And here we go. Oh, hey, 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 get away from me. Fuck! Welcome to Twin River Diner. How are you doing today? Good, uh, how about you? Feel free to take any seat you like and I'll be right with you. Thanks. The music is so loud. I wish I could turn the music down just a little bit. Hey, okay, I'll sit here, I guess, since you're already over here. Good evening. I'm Barbara. Are you ready to order? Yes! So what can I get for you today? We will do the grilled cheese with onion rings. No, I don't want to have. And we'll do a large strawberry slushy, baby. Uh, that will be all. I'll bring you food as soon as I'm done. Just let me know if you need anything else. Sounds good. Appreciate Big Preach, dude. I've always had this habit of peeing before eating. Okay, well, I guess that's my fucking cue to get up. We, yeah, there's peeing. There was peeing in the last Fears to Fathom. There's a lot of peeing in this game, and I wanted to see how far away I could pee. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh shit. I'm peeing on the floor. You know, I could stop, right? Man. Well, it evaporated. Whatever. Why did- was there a cutscene to fucking dry my hands? Is that a two-way mirror? There's a black cut screen when I wash my hands. Okay. We're out of here. Was this my spot? God, this would be so cool, like legitimately, to be here in this little mountain town by yourself at the diner. Hello. Wow, that looks yummy. Consuming. Consuming, levitating. I'm consuming and levitating the food. We got three different dips. That's very good. Very good. I don't know why, but onion rings 
with uh, grilled cheese does not sound good. But the slushy does. All right. Uh, I remember there was this diner while passing through Roseburg. They have the best burgers in town. You have to try them. Oh, I didn't get the burger. <gasps> yes, it was great. Check, please. Thank you. Fuck, I was trying to read, woman. How was it? I'm here. It's still eating. This is so good. Told you. Hee hee. This food reminds me. You should send me that casserole recipe you were talking about. I might get a chance to immerse myself in the art of cuisine in the new lookout. Wow, yes. I'm Dude. I'm I'm on my phone. Can't you see that? We'll do 15% tip. Hope you enjoy the rest of your ride. Did I drink my thing? I want to finish reading. Wow, yes. On my way home. Send you in a bit. Okay, cool. All right, up. Up and at them. All right, let's go, baby. Bird up there? There's some sort of bird flying overhead. Some sort of v v raptor. All right, let's get on the road. Maybe I'll see what this guy's up to. I saw him sitting here on this 88 Delta Royal Oldsmobile. How's that burger? This little piece of heaven, this place is pretty much my weekend spot. You know around here? I'm in Stafford, Ironburg State Park. You must have heard the news then. What news? Well, a few weeks ago, three kids went missing in the park. It's been all over the news. What happened to them? No one knows. The official report says they got lost, but a lot of people around here think something else happened. Something else? There's a rumor going around. You know, like Bigfoot or Goatman. People say there's something like that living in that forest. I should go. Ew, that's disgusting. You enjoy that, sir. You enjoy that. I'm at... Bro, I definitely shut my door. What the fuck? I didn't even turn my car off? Now we got our horses back. Woohoo! Coming through, motherfuckers. Okay, there we go. Very nice. Yeah, this is chill. This is chill. Whoa! 8.02 p.m. The trees are dancing. I want to include the location of this park. But I don't want anyone seeking out the utter horrors I've seen in these woods. Huh? Oh, I'm reading the thing. Stop! Alright, we gotta talk to Billy, I think his name was. Drove my RV onto the foot trail. This is a perfect spot. After all, I am. Oh, that's the front door right there. Look at that shit. Excuse me, sir. Oh, shit. Okay. Billy! You gotta take your fucking trash out, bro. <laughs> Whoa, you fucking You scared me, you asshole. I thought you were one of them. One of who, you fucker? May lord have mercy. Oh, anyways, I can see your permit, please. You're Billy, right? I'm the new transferred Sheboygan. Is that correct? I didn't know we were hiring this season. 
I don't give a fuck what you think, bitch. I'm here. Hang on, let me check on that. You know, I could just fucking choke your ass out right now, you fucking bitch. <gasps> yeah, he's gone crazy. He's got the- Oh! Ass! Okay, pal. You're good to go. You're staffed at Fire Tower 11. I apologize for the confusion. I was under the impression that the tower would have been left unstaffed for the season, but here are your keys. Take keys. Tower key. Let me open the trail gate for ya. I, you know, I could just pop right over it. You don't have to do that. Can I get a drink? Can I grab a drink for the night, bro? Thanks, dude. Since you're arriving this late, you might also need this fleshlight for the long hike to your lookout. Thanks, Billy. You be careful. Take this. I took flashlight. Welcome to Ironbark, pal. Now, for our purpose, when you get to your tower, be sure to make your first weather report from your system just so we know you are clocked in safely. If need be, you can reach out to Tower 12 during your staffing. Nice enough guy. He'll be your closest contact in case of any emergency. Thanks, Billy. Hey. Just piece of advice, don't travel any further than half a mile or so north of your tower. Why? Dangerous woods that way, pal. Bobcats and beards. Nasty business. You got it. Can I drive my RV up there? I thought he was trying to scare me. But he looked dead serious. <laughs> well, I can't fucking read anything, so... Jesus, everything is alive! Here we go. I left my bag in the RV! Fucking bitch! God damn it! Imagine if I wouldn't have read that, bro. Oh, and I fucking forgot it. Bill, if you jump scare me again, I'm gonna be mighty upset at you. There it is. Alright, got my bag, Billy. See ya, you fucker. 11.32 p.m. It was a long hike and it was starting to get dark, cold or something. I couldn't read it. Tower 11, frequency 155-925-00. 155-925-125. Yeah, this would be fucking terrifying. 155-925. 155-925. Living in a fire tower was not a glamorous job. Imagine being out here alone for weeks at a time. It's not for everyone. I would love it. I wouldn't love the porta potty though. Utility shack. I'm sure we're gonna have to turn that on at some fucking point. I ascended the stairs to the top of the tower. Oh! I see another guy over there. Once you're on top of the tower, your job is to look for fires or anything out of the ordinary. God, this would be amazing! Wait, wait, wait. This is it? This is it? I was finally in my new home for the, the next few months. Yeah, I tried to turn on the fucking generator. Can I fill it up with gas while I'm down here? I'm not forgetting. I want to do it. Oh. There you go. Have some gas, bitch. Alright, we're going home. We're going back up. I can't figure out how to make fire. Whatever. Turn it on, please. There we go. Jesus Christ. It's 
So what do we got here? You want he wanted me to do something when I got here. Ah, uh, oh my god. List of an initializing AZ Starting Really? Password 125-925-00 Check the iron bark rules flyer Hmm Radio equipment was sitting on a wooden table Here we go, baby Static Lights out after 12. Supply drops are handed out every Sunday. Absolutely no guest. System password is iron bark. 11. Refuel the generator routinely. Update the reporting software routinely. No video games in the system. Remember to call your sister station before sleep. Iron bark 11. All right, so we'll log on iron bark 11. Iron Bark Eleven. We're in. Ding dong. Uh, oh. Hello there, I'm Smiley, your trusty virtual assistant, here to help you make the most of your computer today. Good evening, Tower 11. How's your day going? Surprise, you found me. How can I assist you today? Plague? I ain't clicking on that. Welcome to the city. Our service repair. You guy, you haven't gotten your name yet. Hey, bitch, I'm trying to read. I'm Jack. I your light turn on. I gotta say, it's refreshing to see Tower 11 alive again. Who's Connor. You were watching? At the job. We've had to cover your area until you arrived. Anyways, what brings you to this towering paradise of ours? I'm just looking for a change. I'm transferring from Iron Horse. An experienced comrade. I can see why Mitch picked you. You got a fire going? Get her lit. The temperature is about to plummet. You don't want to sit through the storm shivering. Okay, so we're going to do temperature, wind speed, and number of hikers assisted. I don't see the smoke. Did you light it up yet? The wood stove should be around the entrance. Get her lit. This gasoline does not work. Well, I need wood. Hello. I need wood. Where can I get some fucking wood? It won't let me leave and I don't have wood. Can you help me, sir, please? I got gasoline all over the fucking place. There's no firewood, god damn it. Marley. Fuck. She was one gritty woman. Anyways, you better get that fire going. You don't want to sit through the storm. Gasoline must be in your cabin. But if not, you can always grab your supplies from the storage shack. I was trying to go down there to get stuff, but the game would not allow me without talking to you fucking first. Okay, I'm going down, going down. I forgot my fucking flashlight, son of a bitch. Bear maze. All right, we're going back up. Okay. Work, baby. 
Needed gasoline. I just poured gasoline all over the fucking thing. God damn it. Is that enough? Jesus Christ, that took so long to fucking do that. Ah, I see it. I see the smoke. Great. Nice to see Tower 11 alive again. Uh, you you've already... No, I'll do it. So I need wind. Pretty sure it was 18 knots about five seconds ago. Do you see me? I'm out here. 18 knots on the wind. Oh, shit! <gasps> we got... We're looking north. Okay, good job. North is still north. We got our binox. Good, 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 good. The clouds. Uh, we'll look at the clouds, I guess. Fuck it. Ooh, I like that zoom. The clouds are looking medium to splendorific. Holy shit, we are out there now. I see you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Are you out there? No, there's a tree. Bitch. I didn't check the temperature. Fucker. Fucker, fucker, fucker. Do we have weather apps that do that? Get up. Where's my temperature gauge? I want... I want a temperature doodad. Where's my thermometer? Is there a thermometer around here? Did you report for the night yet? Better get to it then. Here at Iron Bark, you are required to report every night before signing off. Okay, you buddy. Don't want to Mitch on your first night. I don't know what the temperature is. There's pro there has to be a temperature gauge or something out there. Sir, can you please help me? Why wouldn't this tell me the temperature? Oh, it's right here. I'm a fucking moron. 45. Forty-eight or something? Let's get these bitches out. So... Forty. That's fifty, sixty. It's right in the middle. Forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five. No, so those are twos. Two, four, six. So it's 46 degrees. 46 degrees exactly. I had 46 on there. Welcome to Ironbark State Park. Oh my god. If you're watching this video, then let me be the first to say it's fucking congratulations. It's the dude. You have been commissioned by the Ironbark State Department to protect one of the most prestigious parks in the state of Washington. Parks. Established in 1897. Okay. Okay, I'm a mm. I have spent 20 fucking minutes trying to figure this out, and I didn't realize you could click on the fucking thermometer. I was over here with fucking binoculars, looking at this fucking thing, right here. Right here. This is what I was doing. 46. Igs fucking exactly. But no, it wasn't good enough. You need to click on the thermometer. It's 44.6 fucking degrees. Oh my god. Jesus. You're an asshole. I think I'm gonna sign off for the day. Me too, no, you, you bitch. Off. Don't let the bed bugs bite. 
Fuck you. Good night. Over and out. I think I'm going to fill my generator before I go to sleep. There you go. Fuck you. You're full. Alright, I'm going to bed. I'm going to bed. Uh, good night. That was so fucking difficult. God damn it! Uh oh. Oh shit. What's happening? Connor? I had to pee. I gotta go all the way downstairs to pee! My bag and my flashlight are gone! Fuck! On my first night, being out of the cabin gave me a strange feeling. Being left here alone was somewhat unsettling. Oh, I could just pee right off the thing. Very nice. Woohoo! Yeah, baby. No one can see me. There's a fucking wolf out there, dude. Good night. Night two. Oh, this is nice. It's just you and the wind, and the time just melts away. Yeah, this would be so fucking dope. So nice. Man, look at this. We'll take a photo of the sunset. So freaking nice. Space to get off. I want to get off. I wanted to see the thing that told me how much my generator has. <coughs> it hasn't moved at all. Okay. Oh, copy. shit. I most certainly do. Tower 12. I know. Yes, I do. Tower 11. Do you copy? Yes, Son dude. Bitch. Excuse me? Bothers to get a camping permit these days anymore. Do you have eyes on the smoke north of your position? Uh-oh. Let me have a look. North. That... I need my... Thermometer. Or whatever this is. My hands are full. Get out of my hands. North is... Oh, shit. Yeah, I see it, brother. Can I turn this off? Holy crap. Oh, yeah, baby. I got your ass. I got you, Ath. I need you to confirm. Do you see that smoke? I see the smoke, buddy. You spot that white smoke up north? Yes. It appears to be in the lazy trail sector, which is not a registered campsite. Ooh. People like that don't bother to clean up after themselves. Ooh. Fire risks are high this season. Am oh. I checking it out? Yes. No do you have any other details? Follow Lacey Trail. Don't forget to carry your bear spray in these woods, new guy. Don't worry out. Lacey Trail. Okay. Where's Lacey Trail? North was this way. I was on the wrong trail. Seems like I go faster when I do this little sideways. Ooh. 
Lacy Trail, baby. 8.37 p.m. and I don't have a flashlight. This... Bro, if you hear screams, it's time to call 911. Sir, this is an unregistered campsite. I'm gonna need you to bend over and spread them immediately. What the fuck? I'm sorry, Kay. I don't have good service. Here- Oh, those are the actual pictures I took. Is everyone dead? Hello? I'll just spray down their stuff. Teach them a lesson. Who's there? I don't see anything. Show yourself. I think we should leave. Oh, I could put the fire out with this water. Bitch. But it's going to get dark. Fuck you! Leaving. Bye. My job is done, right? I put the fire out. As I hike back to my tower through the dark. I couldn't shake the sense that something was terribly wrong. My mind couldn't help but think what might have happened. Yeah, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna leave you right on the stairs up a little bit more. Right here. You stay there. I had to report to Connor about the vacant. Okay, but I want to shut some of these. I just like one or two open. That's more cozy. Alright, sir. This is what happened. They're all fucking dead. Loud and clear, new guy. I was just cooking myself some hot... Well, first, what's your status? Are you kidding me? No, I'm not. Has this happened a lot? This month alone. Anything else you notice in those woods? A scream. Must have been one of those red foxes. They sound pretty much like a screaming lady at night. It was a manly scream.
What happened to those kids? Their parents said some whistle led them off the trail. It's unbelievable. I heard the whistle. Keep me updated over and out, buddy. Well, I guess we will take our nightly readings. It is 48.3. We'll get a little wind reading here. 21. It is 48.3, 0, a little windy, cloudy. Okay, that's me. Oh! It's a game within a game. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Holy shit. It'd be great if I had a better gun. Alright, I'm done. I got 500 points. Done. Exit. That was fun. Okay. We're gonna exit out of here. I spent too much time on that. Fuck! Oh, here we go. Not delivered, not delivered. Shit! Alright, so I need to make these things. I believe. Am I really gonna make this? I wasn't sure when I, I wasn't sure that went in. Oh, I'm actually looking at what I'm getting. Shit. So we got moz mozzarella cheese, diced tomatoes, pepperoni, and uncooked pasta. No, no. Diced tomatoes. Pasta. We got the diced tomatoes, mozzarella, marinara, pasta. Now we just need pepperoni. It looks like it's already in there. Okay, we'll add more pepperonis. There you go. Oven. Close. Look at this gosh darn mess. Well, it's going off. Oh my god, what happened? I just bugged the fucking game. No way. I just fell through the fucking floor. Damn it. Get out of my hand. This, this is, is so, so fucking, fucking dumb. dumb. We're gonna see how far back we go. Fuck! Whoa, I could carry the flashlight and the bear maze. Okay, so we didn't have to go back that far. Thank God. I don't know what I did. I just opened the door to throw the food out and then I fell through the fucking floor. I will not go falling through the floor this time. Hey, you there? New guy. Okay. 
What is it? Just reported their ass to the authorities. Okay, good job. What did they say? Don't worry. Forest Service Agency will take care of it first thing in the morning. We'll That's relieving. Connor. Over 12, signing off. Over and out. Oh. Done. Where do I set it? I like eating in bed. Okay. God damn, this game drives me fucking crazy. Oh my gosh. Oh, I hate it so much. I was already full, you pussy. Eat all of it, man. Can we put it in the fridge? Oh, we can. Look at that. It's in the fridge. We shall go to sleep. Uh, I was getting cold. Start the fucking stove. I gotta go downstairs. That means... Shit. 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 Oh no, I gotta leave my mace down here. That means fuck. I hear somebody. I'm running. But I heard walking. Nice healthy dose of that. I'm going to sleep. I have to close every board. God damn it. Okay. Uh, I'm sure the generator's gonna run out and we're gonna have to go down there and fill it up with gas in the middle of the night. 2.27 a.m. We should be asleep. I was woken by some feeling that caused my eyes to drift open. I don't want to get up. What the fuck is that shadow? There's something out my window, bro. I saw you, you asshole. There was something very strange about that night. Yeah, like the fucking demon I just saw. <gasps> oh my god. What is it doing? Shut it! I don't have my fucking spray. I do have my spray, thank you God! Oh! <gasps> oh! Come here, bitch. I don't know what to make of it. Bro, something terrible has happened. Connor, do you copy? I need to talk to you, it's urgent. You there. Any idea what time it is? Motherfucker, it's an emergency. There's something outside my door. There's a skull! Oh 
that's what your response to what just fucking happened to me is? Bro, if it happens again, I'm blasting. Feels like a ritual, you idiot. We're in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Here's what we'll do. I'll send someone to check in on you tomorrow. For now, just lock your door, take a deep breath, and try to get some rest. We can't do much. It'll be morning before you know it. Try to get some sleep, Jack. Connor didn't make any sense. I agree. But there's not much else I could have done in the dark. Night three. Next day I woke up not sure if it was a dream or if it was real. Connor tried to reason it as a harmless prank by some kids. But there's something about that night that just felt darker. There's something strange happening in those woods. 8.34 p.m. Bitch. Okay, why am I out here with binoculars in my hand? Ooh. I occupied most of the days either with a simple maintenance in or around the tower. Oh. Ooh, this is nice. My paranoia for these woods only grew. Oh, extra vigilant. What was that? Someone just launched a fucking rocket, my guy. Oh, 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 whoa, 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 what the hell? I'd like to report a rocket, sir. Hello? Is anyone there? I, I need help! What Please, happened? Someone answer. Okay. Hello? Can anyone hear me? This is Jack Tower 11. Thank goodness. Uh, I'm lost, and I'm, I'm really starting to freak out. What's I, going on? I don't even know where to start. I went out to explore the area and lost track of time, and, and now it's dark, and I can't remember the trail back to my truck. I think... I think I'm lost. Can you... What is your current location? I'm wearing a red jacket, camo pants, and a green backpack. What is the equipment you have, have with you? I have a flashlight, a compass, a fully charged two-way radio, a flare gun, and, and some of my camping equipment. What is your current location? I'm in the middle of the woods. On this trail surrounded by trees. Oh. Everything looks different at night. I thought shooting a few flare gun shots might get someone's attention, but no one's come yet. All it did was oh. plant the trees and make everything look even scarier. I just want to find a way out of here. You lit a fucking tree on fire, you idiot. I'm surrounded by trees, and I remember passing a small stream earlier. I'm walking towards west right now, because I remember walking east when I came here. Oh, thank goodness. I see it. See I'm at what? a trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Can you help me? Let me scan the map. Stand up. Okay, he... Uh, hello? Uh, are, are you still there? Both of these trails pretty similar. I, I'm just so anxious about making a mistake and going further away from the road. You're trying to get back to the road? I'm at a trail intersection now, but I, I can't remember if I should take the right Fuck trail. Fuck it, take the left trail. I knew it. I thought it looked familiar. I couldn't have trusted myself with this decision. <laughs> Thanks for helping me through this. Making decisions in the dark can be challenging. He's dead. I hear you. I hear your whistles. I'm in my tower. I see you behind the. You're That's not me. Hey. What the fuck? What's up, bitch? Get out of my hands. What's up, bitch? What are you doing out there? Oh, you... What took you so long in there? I've been, I've been knocking for hours. I was asked to check on you. You have not been knocking for hours, you fucking cock. Where are you up to, pal? 
I was assisting a lost hiker, you cunt. May the Lord be merciful. Anyways, got your tower supplies here, just the usual essentials. Here you go, I feel like I'm going to pass out if I keep holding this for one more second. You're a little punk. What were you doing there last night? What do you mean? Up north, why were you there? I wouldn't screw around out there, pal. I was required to investigate on a campfire smoke. Oh lord, nasty business up there, pal. Bobcats and bears. You be careful out there, pal. These woods aren't normal, and there's stuff out there that would love to get a piece of you. Not to mention you'd be quite a distance from help if anything happened. I've got enough to keep me occupied here. Absolutely, it's a busy job. I've been hearing you on the bit in the edge. Everything all right? Just getting used to the new environment. Mention the skull, yeah. Oh lord, have mercy. Did you take a photo before cleaning it up? No. You know, it's best we don't dwell on these things, pal. Besides, we can't do anything without the evidence. Anyways, it's getting late. I better get going now. Just keep watch. Thanks for the supplies, you bitch. I wonder how far he goes. He's gone. Okay, 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 okay. Set it down. Oh, I could finish this. Bitch. There we go. I like to eat in bed. The food was cold. God damn it. This game drives me crazy. Eat that bitch up. Eat the food with your nasty slapping gums. Bitch. Get in there. Alright, I'm going to bed or I gotta do some readings maybe. Alright, let's do our readings. It is 58.1. Oh, I gotta get the stove going too. 58.1, and 25. Very nice. Got that done. We'll get some fire going. Bitch. Oh, you fucking ass. Mm. Bro, these jump scares. These fucking jump scares, bro. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fuck. Who are you? I'm a worker. I was just doing some routine maintenance on the radio tower over there. I thought I'd say hi, the new guy everyone's been talking about. Names can be deceiving. Call me Silius Yellow. Do you usually work this late? Every Sunday, just trying to keep the communication lines open. We must ensure that we that the right message reach the right place, wouldn't you agree? I agree, fire risks are high in the season. Absolutely, but some fires are meant to burn and no amount of prevention can stop them. Nature has its own plans. Some things can't be controlled no matter how hard we try. And sometimes disasters are just another form of cleansing, a way for land to purify itself. Have a good night, Jack. Hope you sleep well, but remember... Curiosity can lead to places you'd rather not go. Farewell, Jack. I hate you, sir. The guy gave out the creepiest vibes. Yeah, leave me. Leave me be. Nice healthy dose of some fuel. Get some of this shit going. Yeah, baby. I see the smoke coming out of your tower. Don't tell me you're not in there. New guy. You there? 
don't tell you I'm not in there? What the fuck does that mean, sir? Copy now. Right here. Finally. I've been trying to reach you for a while now. Where have you been? I went down to get firewood. I was down for two minutes. To get just some firewood. Ran right to the radio tower worker. The guy maintaining the nearby radio tower. Oh, so he was a fucking asshole. I understand. It was closed down years ago after a lightning strike fried its systems. And its repair cost was deemed too costly. Its repair date was postponed until the next big funding, which is no time soon, according to Mitch. Then who did I just talk to? you're saying is true, it could be another one of those goons playing pranks on you. Do your name. You think he's been listening? Possibly. Oh. Next time you see him, get his information or take a photo. We need to figure this out. Oh, I'll just spray him with fucking bear mace. Anyways, I'm seeing that you've already reported. I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. Me Tower too. 12, signing off. Over. Okay. Goodbye. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's my mace. We got our little fire, and I'm going to sleep. Oh my god, that's fucking dark. And we're on tonight something. My knees are starting to grow with each passing day. So when I signed off that night, I told myself that it was just a change of environment that I needed getting used to. The strangeness I'd seen so far in those woods was not enough to cause an alarm. It was not enough to cause an alarm yet? Like the fucking guy that got attacked by the whistling fucking thing? Well, I'm listening. Just heard from the HQ. They say we've got a new system update on the computer. Oh, cool. Wanted me to let you know. They say it's an important security update. Oh. No more snoopers, I guess. Oh. How do well, I the computer? to be honest with you, all this new technology is not really my thing. Dare I say it? These computers are probably going to take all our jobs one day. Mmm. Anyways, for now, use the console to run the new system update. I'm sure a young man like you can figure it out. Do I hear a mouse or something? Alright guys, unfortunately that's going to be it for this one. I certainly hope you all sure did enjoy. Did, did, did enjoy! If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, come back to the next one. Until next time, see ya.